Hi everybody, it's Mariah. And Raven. And welcome to another episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. We were not here the last two weeks. The last two weeks we did not have any episodes of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. That's because uh, we just didn't. We, he, we're busy, we've been doing things. <laughs> Raja is still out of town. I miss her so much, I found her wig. She left and I decided to wear it. <laughs> I'm having a blast with our special guests that we've had, oh. but congratulations to Raja on her one woman show that's been selling out in every night that she's been doing it in Provincetown. So hurry back and we'll see you then. You better get them coins, bitch. And speaking of paying homage and doing throwbacks, guess who I'm paying uh, homage to today? Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> <laughs> A bandage dress and a, a, a nondescript ponytail. <laughs> nondescript, Gia Gun. <laughs> there we go. So we got Raja and Gia Gun today. In the house. In the house. <laughs> so, what are we doing today, girl? Today, we're going to be tuning and booting the looks from the red carpet of the VMA. Oh, delicious. It's been two years since I was at the VMAs. When you were at the VMAs in two years ago? With Miley Cyrus, I was on stage. With oh, about that's right. Thirty other drag queens. Wait, I thought that was last year. That was two years ago. Mm -hmm. oh. I still have the pay stub. I haven't paid taxes on yet. Damn. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They took all of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gotta love Uncle Sam. Okay. Hey, girl. The celebrities were on uh, the blue carpet of the VMAs. It was hosted by Katy Perry, which awesome. apparently. Was she good? I don't know. Whatever. But we're not going to talk about that. We're talking about the looks. We're talking about the looks. There were a couple of monumental moments that happened at the 2017 uh, VMAs. I did, I did YouTube one of those moments, and I think it was uh, Pink's uh, acceptance speech, which I thought was very heartfelt and warm, and I think our country needed to hear that. And she is first up on the blue carpet. Pink on blue. She's in a suit. So you know I like a suit, and it has pockets. I love a good pocket, a good Peter pocket. Keeps my hands mm, warm. I love a pocket too. Uh, girl. We're very dirty here. We're filthy and that's why we still work. <sighs> um, Sexually suppressed. Here's the thing about this. I wish the pants fit a little better. Well, I like the, the, the way that the pants drop. Uh, it's perfect and plumb to the floor, but the waistline is what's getting me. I think it should have been fitted right to below the pocket and then kind of flare out a little. Not like a flare like down at the knee, yeah. but like just a, li a little more tailored. Yeah, it's just like... It's little, it looks like a little girl who's playing in her dad's clothes. Yeah, I like the message of it. It's like so unisex, and uh, but just the tailoring, just a little bit more. But you know, pink is rad and badass anyway. I'd love to see uh, if she would have had pictures with the jacket off, like kind of tossed over the shoulder, mm. kind of GQ magazine cover. I think that would have been awesome. I give this a boot. The pants should have fit better. I, I love the statement. I love that, but we're not talking about statement. We're not talking about inner beauty. We're not talking about any of that. We're talking about the look of the clothes on the runway or on the carpet. Based off of that, I'm gonna have to give it a boot too. Yeah, it's a boot. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just wish the pants fit a little bit better. But we still love her. You're rad, Pink. Paris Jackson, a boot. Okay, As yeah. much as I would like to say this is cute and flirty and fun, it's, it's very underwhelming. It, yeah, it's, it's like the the person with too much money that goes to Coachella. Yeah, trying to that's look like, poor. Oh, I've got you know. I just I, what's clean? Yes. And if that were the case, I would love it. But this, I mean, you can see. Is that her underwear? I, yeah, this there, features, those are bloomers. Those are underwear. This whole look is just a miss for me. I don't like this look. I want it to go away. So boot. Yeah. Bye. Complete boot. Don't make me look at it again. Olivia Munn. Some people have too much time on their hands and just want to look like potholders. <laughs> that looks like something, so, like a like a placemat or something. I just don't like it. You know, I like elements of this. Like I love the fabric of the dress, but then all of the stuff that's going on, it just. I think if it didn't have all that extra busyness um, right here in the midsection, it, the, like I said, like you said, the fabric is amazing. I love the length of the dress. I love the cut of it. So, what okay. do you give this a tutor a boot? Girl, a, a strong, a strong boot. A strong boot. A strong like a steel-toed boot. boot. Oh, <laughs> Damn, bitch. Steel-toed, high-tech army boot. 
with a Vibram sole that uh -huh. she gets a boot. So what do you think of this uh, look? You know, I don't, I don't care for it either. I love the makeup and the hair. Yeah. And I like the silhouette of this, but I don't, I just, don't, I don't care for it. Yeah, she has great legs though. She's got beautiful legs, and I don't know who made this dress. She probably made it with her feet. It's a boot. <laughs> Crocheted it with her feet. She's with her toes. With her long soft. toes. <laughs> <laughs> toes so. that look like they play for the sparks. <laughs> <laughs> Boo. So this is Noah Cyrus, Miley Cyrus' sister. I actually don't mind this look, but again, like when Delta's been here, and she's like, not minding right. and not liking are the same thing. Yeah. It, this, I don't know. Okay, I realize this is the VMAs, but like what year is this? 2017. And uh, we've come a long way in fashion. And I, I, I get the whole, I don't care, I'm just gonna, I'm too cool to care. No, girl. It, See, I would have liked this look with the shoes that the previous bitch was wearing. Right. And without these sunglasses. Yeah. But this, to me, looks fucking lazy. This bitch looked like she showed up, like she said, I'm someone's sister. Yeah. Like, this looks like, so, like oh, I'm someone's sister. I'm here, I got I'm invited. I'm someone's plus one. Yeah. Nobody's photographing me. Yeah, so. I, I mean, it's, but they did. They did Blanche. They photographed her. It's Dorothy. <laughs> oh, will you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, you get it. Boot! This is something that you wear after you've done a drag show and you want something really comfortable to walk through the club in. Because you pulled your nuts out and you pulled your pads off. Yeah. This look is not for any carpet, so boot. Okay, so next up we have Miss Melanie Brown. Yes. Or Scary Spice. Scary Spice. She is a judge on America's Got Talent. She's been doing big things. She is one of my favorites. She has like a girls. fitness video too. She she's looks very she's fit. in shape and I love it. So this is a statement piece. I actually like it. I do like it. I love the silhouette, but why are you walking onto a blue carpet, a red carpet, a pink carpet, on any but fucking carpet, trying to like, do that. Having a message. It was her moment to have a message. And I realized have a message, but don't do it there. Like, this, and this she, is, I don't, I don't. It could have also been, she could have been speaking to the music industry as well. It's, I think it has a couple of meanings. This dress to me is a boot. Can't talk me out of it. Okay. And I know, I, I know, won't. and I know Raja would try to, but I would still say no girl. Like, and yet, look at her hair. She just kind of, she looks like a little disheveled. And I realize the message that's come, but come on, show up and be like, bitch, you will never own me. Right. Look at this, hunty. All of that. Now, see, I'm, I'm, I'm down for the look. It I'm would. gonna, I'm gonna give this one a two. You would. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nicki Minaj. Uh huh. In pink. Now, I did see a picture of her vagina going around. In this. Does she look like her vagina in this? Um, in the in the picture that I saw of a close-up of her vagina. Of her moose knuckle. It, but it wasn't even, it, one side was a moose knuckle and one side was a camel toe. Girl, she It was a, like. Oh, it looked like, you know, it she had looked a like, side nut. Yes, that's exactly, <laughs> it looked like she tucked and her nut popped. Okay. That's what it looked like. Okay, so uh, Nicki Minaj got side nut, y'all. I do like this look, but I feel it, I don't know what's going I feel on. She's, I feel she's done this look so many times. And it's to me, it's just the basic um, hip hop I, Barbie. I think she looks beautiful she looks here. I love the two tone hair, three yeah. tones, depending if you want to count the roots. But I don't like the way this is like buckling and then this is smashing the titties. And then it just, I, no, girl. And then those, those shoes. You're wearing this beautiful, glamorous, like choker, like kind of like ferocious. Wear a like a like a just bitchy heel with rhinestones on it. Hmm. Looks like she's wearing tennis shoes, right? Like she's gonna go running. It, to me, this is pussy. not this is not carpet worthy. It just seems to be one of the B-roll looks from one of her videos. Yes. Yeah. Boo. Yeah, boo. Oh we gosh. have Kesha <sighs> in a toilet paper cozy. This no, is... No, it's not the toilet paper cozy. It's worse than that. It's the little uh, toilet brush cozy. It's the actual right toilet to, brush. Next to the... That's um, been used uh -huh. in actual sh In water. the pee zone. <laughs> in the splash zone. I love the little black bows with the... And the way this... This is... But this is all I like. From here 
up. I like yeah. the hair. I like the top part of this. this From there, the way it comes out, it looks awful. It looks like a, an appropriate like pregnancy dress. Is she pregnant? She could be. That's an awful thing to ask a woman. Well, I didn't you ask. Never her. know. But I just. I, did. I was not commenting. I wasn't commenting on her body. I'm commenting on her dress. We don't body shame here. No. So it's it's a, a nice little. Um, but it's just maternal. not. It's not. This isn't a very flattering look. Mm -mm. It's not flattering. The umpire Even waist it, with all the ruffles. No. no. Boot. Katy no. Perry. I love it. Everything. She, you can tell this bitch Stunning. is the host of the show off of this picture alone off this image. But girl, you should, you, you, should also, you should still show up even if you're not the host. Right. Go, I'm still gonna look good. This, this bitch is right here. Carpet worthy. That's, this is what I'm talking about. I've been, this is what I've been missing today. It's beautiful. Lovely. Uh, the hair, the style of this dress, the jewelry, the makeup. Guess what? Swish, swish, bitch. <laughs> no, she said bish. Wish, because wish, that's bish. the family friendly version, isn't it? Because I think that's like. Do you remember? Um, do you remember that song "Work Bitch" by Britney Spears when it play on the radio? Uh huh. It'd say you better work, work. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember that? Yeah. <laughs> it, well, I get so annoyed. <laughs> I would be mad. But speaking of work, work, Katy Perry, work. You better work, work. Yeah. <laughs> Two. Oh. So Gigi gorgeous. Yes, is next up. And she's looking gorgeous. This is a this is one of those dresses that's like a very it's kind it's kind of safe, right? Wouldn't you say? Yeah, it's it's, it's very got it's, some boning. It fits well. I love the gold pump. Love the hair. She looks beautiful too. It's a nice safe look. You're gonna toot it or boot it? I guess it'll get a two. It works. For, it works, especially considering what we've already seen. So two. All right, we have Jimmy Lovato. You know what, girl? I love this look for VMAs. And she's like paying homage to MC Hammer with the pants. <laughs> um, I like the little- Madonna with the top. Yes, I like the little peekaboo nipples, her little Hershey kisses. Yeah, I'm down for this. She looks very beautiful. Her makeup, hair is flawless. I think, and it's a complete look from head to toe. So it's I, a toot or a boot? It's a complete toot. Complete? Complete. I mean, it's a it's a look. It's a, a solid look, and it's for the VMAs. Now, of course. Okay, but like, then there are other people that we could have said, but this is for the VMAs. Here's the thing with this: this hair weighs it down. I think the hair should have been pulled out, up, and back. The hair down, to me, it's takes a away from I it. Give it a okay. BB <laughs> Rexha. She is a pop star. She kind of looks a little like Helena Bottom Carter. You know what she looks like? She's farting, actually. She looks oh. like she's like, oh, <laughs> she, She's like, Does hold on. She, she, she thought it was gonna be a, she a thought fart? It was be she's a like, silent oh, one. Oh. And she realized she was, uh, she had taken an ally. It had, <laughs> had an oily discharge. <laughs> And it's running down her leg. <laughs> but nobody She's knows. Like, so she crossed that leg real quick. <laughs> the paneling, the, 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 the pattern, the beatings, all of that. It looks cheap. Does it not look cheap? Yeah. If you look at this photo, it looks cheap. The girl, she finally discovered Santee Alley in the garment district. And then farted in the dress. <laughs> farted and she sharded. Um, this right, um, you can tell she put effort into it. I think that she should have gotten a different stylist that could have done things differently for her. Or maybe given her liposine instead of ally. Uh, <laughs> 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 I mean, this one's a complete oily toot. It's a toot? A, a oily toot. Oily toot? Uh-huh. Okay, you love it? Uh, no. Oh, no. Boot. A boot is... I'm sorry. A boot is back. I was thinking of, like, the, the discharge. I'm sorry. The discharge. <laughs> She's thinking of her discharge. Uh -huh. That's why we need to hurry and wrap this up. Okay, sorry. Um, I, you know, I, I, I'm on the fence. And because I'm on the fence, I'm going to go to the dark side. Okay, Amber Rose came to play games. Yes, she did. Two. Complete two. I don't know if I, I'm down with the hair. I want the hair color to be a little more intentional. I want no hair. I, I, I think she looks beautiful she's, with no hair. She's always gorgeous with no hair. You know she's, she walk, uh, she's from the ballroom scene too. Oh, she is. Uh-huh, she used to walk women's face. Women's face? Uh-huh. You know, that has all gender representation. Femme queen face, which is trans women, butch queen face, which is gay man, drag queen, and women's face, and then um, butch face, which is the trans men. Oh. Yeah. 
So well, she used to walk with his face for the House of Mizrahi. I love that she's wearing a wig. I love that she said, I'm gonna change this up going mm -hmm. to the VMAs. But this dress, I don't care. If you, if this would just, the head would just blocked off and I didn't know who it was, I would say this is one too. Here's two. Two. I like it because it's done well. Like, the, the design of the dress is just, it's very body conscious and she has the body for it. And I love a nice wicked black and she's a wicked beauty. I love that. But she's always a scandal. But this one is like, Tasteful scandal. Tasteful scandal too. Mm -hmm. Next we have Alessandra Ambrosia, Victoria's Secret model. It's sick. I love it. It's sickening. It's very. You can tell there's a lot of detail put into the the garment. Uh, she's wearing it well. Oh, but are I, they okay? So, but I want something else with the hair. I see, and I do too. But I also am looking at this and I'm thinking to myself, wait a minute, is this dress? And these boots, are they from the same collection? Or are, is it actually something made to go together? Yeah, did she do the granimal thing? Like where she's like, like okay, I'm gonna do this. Like, I, I feel like it should have a different boot or a different shoe. Like I would actually like this dress if it were, if she had maybe like a little Mary Jane on. It's got the collars, looks like she's going to school. But with the boot, I don't like it, the boot. I have to give it a two. Girl. Bye. Vanessa Hutchins. <laughs> Bye. I don't like this when they do the, the, the huge window through the center of the dress. It makes no sense. The length doesn't make any sense to me. The, uh, now if she wouldn't have had like the, from the sheer part down is what messed this look up for me. She could have left that sheer panel and the rest of the, ga the gown off and just had it like a short ballerina length skirt. And I think that would have been Really sickening. Yeah, it's a boot for me. Boot. Oh Lord. The dress but, is pretty, styling is wrong. Completely wrong, and it looks like she's miserable in it. Oh, stay she home. She had the flu. Here's the thing. The, every time she shows up, she's apparently like, I'm not feeling well, I, I'm sick. If you have resting bitch face, just can own it. Completely. Like, she always shows up and looks like she's miserable. It, it looks very lazy, like somebody sent it to her, she's like, oh yeah, I guess I have to. Like, if you look miserable, keep that energy at home, honey. Yeah, stay your ass at home. Yeah, I'm and sure. And now I'm miserable, so we need to hurry up, because right. I want to go. Yeah, Boo. so, bye girl, boo. Trend alert! Mixed fabrics. fabrics. Fabrics that are mixed up. That cause mixed feelings. <laughs> Ooh, mix up my bowels. Oh, swish it around. Swish, swish, bish. Mix, mix, bish. Uh -huh. <laughs> work, work. <laughs> Our, Our top, top two of the, the week is, is Miss Katy Perry. Katy Perry. Yay! And in a so close, good. close, close. Close, close, close. It was like this. Miss Amber Rose. Yeah. Shall honorable be. mention. Yeah. I love an honorable mention. So congratulations, Katy Perry, and all of our other blue carpet nominees. Don't, Don't forget, forget to subscribe to Wow Presents. What work? work. <laughs>